I get very less pay. Only 11232? Oh, not so popular company. Dear students, today you must be thinking what ma'am is talking about. It has no relation with chemistry. But, my dear students, it is very much related with chemistry. Let me tell you that. Now, let's get started. Today, we are going to learn the trick to memorize some polyatomic ions along with their charges which will help you to frame or make chemical formulae. But which tool we will use? So my dear students, the same tool which is known as mnemonics. Now on the screen children, you are seeing the first line which is written as, oh, not so popular company. Now what you will do, the first step, I will see the first two letters in every word in the sentence and I will write the first two letters under that. Let me do that. So it goes like this. The first word O, it contains two letters, so I will write it O H. The second word not contains three letters, but I will take only the first two, I will write N O. The next is so, already two letters, I will write S O. The next is popular, first two letters only I will take. I will write P O. The last that is company, I will take first two letters that is C O. My task is finished. I have written the first two letters of every word from the first line. Now what is my next step? My next step is I will see the second line. It goes like this. I get very less pay. What I am going to do with the second line? I will count the number of letters from the second line of every word and I will write the total number of letters on it. How? Let us do that also. First word is I. How many letters? One. So I will write one. How many letters get? 3. I will write 3. How many letters? That is 4. I will write 4. How many letters next? That is 4. I will write 4. How many letters? 3. I will write 3. Now what should be my next step? My next step will be that I will see the first letter how many letters were there? It was having one. I will pick up this one. I will write it over here. But if I write it one or if I do not write one, hardly makes a difference. OH will remain OH. So if we do not even write one, it is having no difference. So I will remove it. OH or OH1, no difference. Next. Next is, that is, 3. So, I will write 3 at the base NO3. Next is 4. I will write 4 at the base. Next is 4. I will write 4 at the base. Last is 3. I will write 3 at the base. I finished with this task. Now, my last step is I am seeing the number 11232. What I am going to do with this number? Of course, it has a vital role to play. But what? Let us see that also. I will see this number. First number is 1. 
So what I'm going to do it, I will pick up this number, I will write minus 1 on the top. Next number is also 1, I will pick up this number, I will write minus 1 on the top. Next number is 2, I will pick up this number 2, I will write minus 2 on the top. I will pick up this number 3, I will write minus 3 on the top. I will pick up this number 2 and I will write minus 2 on the top. Oh my God! While playing with this mnemonics, I made 5 polyatomic ions. My God! In just few minutes? Oh my God! I am so happy that I have learnt in a playful manner 5 polyatomic ions and that too I have learned the formula, I have learned the valency, I have learned the charges. I am so happy. I can even teach others. Okay, one thing is left. What is it? I also have to write the names of this also. But I know the names. So, OH is known as hydroxide. Let us write it. This is known as nitrate. Let us write it. I have understood very well. This is known as sulphate. Okay. Now, though I can write it in minutes. This is known as phosphate. I can remember this for a longer period of time. And the last one is carbonate. I know now how to write it and memorize. So, in this way, children, I have learned some polyatomic ions, its formula, its valency, its charge on it in a playful manner with the help of a tool which is known as mnemonics. So, the basic thing is this, students, that I have taken one example and I have taught you some of the polyatomic ions in this way, framing out one mnemonic. You have to think it over, the mnemonic and even taking some of the polyatomic ions that how should I frame, how should I collaborate the mnemonics so that I can make it the polyatomic ions in a very easy manner. So, children, please try it on your own also. Take some mnemonics. Please make some mnemonics like this and interrelate all these things which I have taught you today in a very easy manner and you will not ratify the things at all. Rather, you will feel happy and learn in a fun loving manner and you will memorize for a longer period of time. So, today we have learned some polyatomic ions in a playful manner. Okay, children, with this I end up and thank you so much. Have a nice day, children. God bless.